I can see perfectly. Mystery box, mystery box, what you got for us today? Oh, that. This is World of Warriors, which, very, very oddly for this channel, isn't something that's horribly out of date. I think you can still buy these in the shops, which makes a nice change. There are 120 to collect, and I don't really understand what they are. So, warriors, they inhabit a world. There is fighting, heavy web-based thing going on. Let battle commence with this small nodule sticking out between two T's. What a beautiful image. Right, so uh, colours and styles, my very first show in the packaging. That's kind of the point of a blind bag, isn't it? Not three sad onions and all that. Well, you get two warriors inside, and the look of the warriors, there's like a kid from where the wild things are, some sort of uh, angry man from a tribe or something. So, a gladiator with the world's worst helmet, ninja. Don't know what's going on there. Haircut 100 having a bit of a Super Saiyan moment. And a Legionnaire with a giant bot. I think there's somebody in there, but I can't quite make him out through the viewfinder. Let me look with my actual eyes. Oh, it's like Genghis Khan or something. Right. What are these things actually like inside? I'm guessing from the front of this, this is some sort of quite uh, internet-based thing. But we care not for ancillary things. On this channel, we care only for the physical toy. Oh, it's getting a bit tardisy, this box, isn't it? Well, that's quite nifty, isn't it? A little shrine to leave your things in, and they are, uh, right, as the whole point is, they stack one on top of each other. And inside we have, oh, for some reason I wasn't expecting it to go like that. Um, let me see, is that to put the little figures on? Do they actually stack? Yes, they do. Well, that was interesting. You go over there. And they're tiny, they've got giant deformed heads, and they're, frankly, not that exciting. Um, right. He's kind of a, I would guess, Mayan warrior or something. He's got a showtel and a s shield and a slightly angry expression and a giant hat. OK. You just stand there, mate. You're going to be just fine. Are you a bit cold? We'll sort that in a second. And the other one is, oh, no. It's one of these ones that's, frankly, um, yeah. Yeah. One of these bloody translucent things. Marvellous. Because, you know, who wants a nice painted one when you could have something that's see-through and naff? Go on then, what's the story then? Oh my god, there are a lot to collect on there. And they all look as generic as assholes. Um, can we find the name of the one I've got here? That one is apparently... Uh, Zengis. I see. And the other one is... Come on, it must be easy to spot. He's got three uh, yellow things in his hat, hasn't he? Um, but I can't spot him in time, and frankly, I can't keep filling time by talking slowly, so we're going to have to give up. If you spotted him at home, well done. Oh, there he is. He's right next to Zengis. Look, he is Ram. I have Ram and Zengis. What a world! What a world we live in. Um, so, yeah, elemental battle or something. Select your World of Warriors character. Make sure your opponent does not see your selected character. Count down from three. Oh, they're like battle beasts or something or others. So they have different... Uh, oh, this one's fire looking, this one's water or something. I understand. Well, I liked the box. Um, I quite liked the uh, Battle Beast concept, I suppose. It's an old good one, isn't it? You know, basically a posh version of uh, Paper, Scissors, Stone. But the little figures are not doing it for me. They're sort of super deformed and very, frankly, generic. Oh, well. No! Ah, everything is better. Oh dear, I think I need to refill this again. I do seem to be getting through a lot of fuel for this recently. Thought you'd got away with it, eh? Refueling jump cut! It's for somebody with the fire element. Doesn't seem particularly, uh phased by it. Ah. World of Warriors, eh? Well, they do say the world's getting hotter. Stop. Drive for more.